أعوذ بالله من الشيطان الرجيم بسم الله الرحمن الرحيم السلام عليكم ورحمة الله وبركاته Welcome everybody to today's class جزاكم الله for all of you who have arrived early We will start today as usual with our daily dua um, Students will follow after me recite the daily dua and then inshallah we will start the class for the day So um, assalamu alaikum discipline in charge Could we please have our first student? Yes, so our first student is C705. G705. Assalamu alaikum. G705. Assalamu alaikum. Assalamu alaikum. Wa alaikum assalam. How are you today? I'm good. How are you? Alhamdulillah. Alhamdulillah, I'm very well. Sakumala for asking. So we're going to start with um, our prayer for the day. So we'll start with Tawuz and Tasmiya and then Wednesday's prayer. Okay, are you ready to follow me? Awuzu billahi min shaitan rajim Bismillah rahman rahim MashaAllah, very quick. Let's do one, one at a time. A'udhu billahi minash shaitanir rajim. A'udhu billahi minash shaitanir rajim. Beautiful. And the translation? I seek refuge white Allah from that hand reached. Very good. I seek refuge with Allah. That means safety. Um, with Allah from Satan the rejected. Well done, good. Bismillahir Rahmanir Rahim. Bismillahir Rahmanir Rahim. Beautiful. And the translation? In the name for of Allah, the gracious, gracious, the mouth. Be merciful. Very good. In the name of Allah, the gracious, the merciful. Well done. And today's prayer. Today is Wednesday. This is our prayer of the day. Rabbi alimni ma huwa khayrun indak. Rabbi alimni. Rabbi alimni. Rabbi alimni ma huwa ma huwa khairun indak khairun indak very good let's try it once all together i'll recite and you try after me so this is a meme here okay rabbi alimni ma huwa Khairun indak. Rabbi alini ma huwa. Khairun indak. Well done, excellent. And the translation? Oh my Lord, teach me what is best for me in you. No words. In your knowledge. Well done. Oh my Lord, teach me what is best for me in your knowledge. Well done. Jazakumullah Sinal Jazar G7005. Okay, so for all students, um, quick reminder, you know the etiquettes by now, mashallah. You should all have your correct ID. If you do not have your correct ID, please name, rename yourself so that your attendance is recorded and you if you you'll only be called if you have the correct ID, you will only be called then to the mic. Um, you should be in ablution with clean clothes and make sure your head is covered, please. Please be in a quiet place. We are reciting the Quran. We need to, need to make sure that that's part of our etiquettes when we're reciting, that we're in a quiet place and we should have parental supervision as well. Jazakumullah. So just a quick reminder um, about the quiz, um, which will be um, uh, this coming week, this coming, uh, sorry, Yes, at the end of this week, that's right, yes. So you'll be having the quiz um, and you need to prepare certain questions for the quiz, which is going to be on Friday. So um, when is it? It's Friday, um, the 7th of October at 6 p.m. So normal 
uh, class time. So you just sign in as you normally would um, to your Zoom lesson. You will prepare with the questions that are available on the Google Drive um, and also provide they are, the questions are provided so you know where you can find the answers. Um, why are we having this quiz? Because G1 is about learning in a fun and positive way. We are not trying to trick you. We are not trying to scare you. We want you to be able to learn the answers so that when we have the quiz, you can all do really, really well, inshallah. Okay. The questions, like we said, are on the Google Drive. Um, there are 12, 13 questions. You have in the Google Drive the page numbers, the lesson numbers, so you can really... Um, look through everything, make sure you find your answers, make sure you know um, what the answers are so that when the quiz comes, you can all get 100% inshallah. Okay, excellent, good. So that's just a reminder about the quiz which is going to take place on Friday in Friday's lesson. Okay, right, excellent. So um, today's lesson, we are going to be learning about a new symbol, um, a new rule, which is sukun. The material that you, if you have the Sinu Al-Quran, the hard copy, the book, it's lesson number 12, which is on page 62. Otherwise, you can find lesson number 12 on the Google Drive with the rest of your resources. The practice texts that we will be looking at today are exercises 12.1 and exercises 12.2. Yeah, exercises 12.1 and 12.2. Both of those exercises will complete today, inshallah. Okay, so let's move on. Sukun, okay, sukun or in English, quiescent. Sakin means the emission of a vowel. When an Arabic letter bears the sign of sukun, it is called sakin. Another well known name of sukun is jazm. For example, nun sakin means the letter nun bearing the sign of sukun. Okay, so what does that mean? It means that um, this stroke or sign here that you can see on top of the letter looks a little bit like a dal. Okay, this is called a uh, sukun. This sign here is called a sukun. You may have know it already as jazm, okay, but we call it a sukun. Right? Um, when um, a letter bears the sukun, that means when there is a sukun, this sign on top of a letter, you would say the name of the letter and then the sakin. So for example, in this case, this is a meme sakin. That means it is a meme with a sukun, this sign on top, right? If we go over here to this letter, this letter is a scene. The sign on top is a sukun. So it is called a seen sakin. That, that means a seen which has the sign of sukun on top. Right? If we go to here, we have a noon. A noon has the sukun, the sign of sukun on top. So this would be called a noon sakin. Again, over here, we have a ra. The sukun sign is on top of the ra. So this is a ra sakin. So every time you see this sign here, which looks like a tiny, tiny little dal on top of a letter, if you see this sign on top of the letter, you will say the letter of that, the, the name of that letter. So for example, seen. And then you will say the word sakin afterwards. That is what letter is. It is a seen sakin, meaning it's a seen with a sukun on top. Okay. It is important to note that a sakin letter must be preceded by a vowed letter. Now, what is a vowed letter? A letter which bears a stroke. A vowed letter is a letter which bears a stroke. Now, what strokes have we learned? We have learned that this is a fata, for example. Just a second, let me get my. Okay, so we know that this, for example, is a fata, right? That is the stroke. That is a voweled letter. This, for example, is a 
Fata Ishbaya. That means it is a vertical fata, right? This is the stroke. This is a voweled letter, right? This here is a dal. Under the dal is a kasra. That is the stroke kasra. That means this dal is a voweled letter. Any letter which has a stroke is a voweled letter, right? So if you have a letter with a sukun on top, or a sakin letter, the letter before it has to be a vowed letter. It must have a stroke on it. Okay. So what do we do with a sakin letter? We join it to the previous letter. Okay. And that's what we're going to be learning today. How to join this letter with the skun to the letter that comes before it. Right. So let me give you an example here. Here we have an alif with a fata. Okay, we would say a, a. But we look closely and we see that the next letter is a lam with a sukun. That means it's a lam sakin. Lam sakin. So we need to join this alif to this lam. How we will do that is we will say al. Al. Okay. Let's go for another letter. Let's look at the next one. Here we have a ha. The ha has a fata, so we will say ha. Next to that, we have a meme with a school. So this is a meme sakin. How will we join this together? We will say ham. Um, right. So the first one here we have al. The next two letters here we have ham. Now this last letter here is has a dhamma. So this is a dal with a dhamma. There is no sakin letter after this, so we will say this letter by itself. Do. Do. Now when we need to put this all together and say the entire word. We will say alhamdu. Alhamdu. Okay. Now, this one here. Now we have a scene with a spoon here. So this is a scene sakin. Before the scene, we have an alif with a kasra. We need to join this alif with this kasra to the scene. We will say is. Is. We next have a kaf with a sukun. The letter preceding it, the letter before it, is a ta with a fatha. We will say tak. Tak. Then we have two letters here which have simple strokes of fatha on both. So we have a ba with a fatha and a ra with a fatha. Ba ra. Ba ra. When we say the whole word together, we say is. Tak baro. Is tak baro. Okay. So if we have a student on the mic, then we will go through and we will be really careful that we join these letters. We don't prolong, we just join them very softly and very simply. Okay. So if we could have a student on the mic, please. Yes. Our next student is G717. G717. Assalamu alaikum. Wa alaikum How are you today? Good. Alhamdulillah. Excellent. Um, are you understanding? Yes. Excellent. So if we start with Dawood and Tasmiya. A'udhu billahi min shaitanir rajeem. Bismillahirrahmanirrahim. Ma beautiful well done excellent so can you tell me uh what letter this is lamb lamb good can you tell me the name of the sign on top of the lamb wow uh -uh, 
This is a sukun. Well done. Excellent. This is a sukun, right? This tells us that we need to join the previous letter. The letter comes before it to this letter. How will we do that? We will say al. <coughs> well done. Excellent. Now, this letter here is a meme. The meme has a sign of sukun which tells us we need to join the letter, the letter before the previous letter to the meme. We will say ham. 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 Very good. What's this letter here? Dal. Excellent. And what's on top of the dal? What stroke is that? Dhamma. Excellent. Do you know how to say that? Yes. How do we say that? Do. Do. Excellent. Well done. Do. Very good. Now let's put this all together. Al, ham, do. Sorry, just a little drink. Al, ham, do. Al, ham, do. Well done. Excellent. So let's try and say it once more. Al, ham, do. Al, ham, do. Very nice. Well done. Excellent. Now, what's this letter here? Do you remember scene. the name of this? Excellent. Scene. What's the sign on top of the scene? Scene. Cool. Sukun. Well done. It's written over here. Sukun. Excellent. So this is known as a scene sakin, right? Now the letter before is alif with a kasa underneath. We will say is. 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 Well done. Excellent. Let's go on to the next one. Here we have a kaf with a sukun. So this is kaf sakin. The letter before is a ta. The ta has a fata, so we will say tak. Tak. Very good. Well done. Now, what are these two letters? Can you tell me? Ba and ra. And very good. Excellent. Ba and ra. So this is, they both have a fata on top. We will say ba ra. Ba ra. Very good. Well done. Let's try and say that all together. We say is tak ba ra. Is tak ba ra. Is tak ba ra. Is tak ba ra. Very good. Now, what we all need to be really careful is, is when we are saying a letter with sukun, we pronounce both the letter that comes before the sukun and the letter that has the sukun very clearly. Okay, so is tak baro. Is tak baro. Very good. Excellent. Well done. Jazakumullah G717. Lovely recitation. Allah Hafiz. Allah Hafiz. If we could have another student, please. Yes, our next student is G seven nine six. G seven nine six. Assalamualaikum. Assalamualaikum. Waalaikum assalam. How are you today? I'm good. How are you? Alhamdulillah, I'm very well. Zakmulla for asking. Um, are you understanding everything? Okay. Yeah. Excellent. So if we start with Dawood and Tasmiya, and then we can begin. Okay, so give me a second. A Rajim, Bismillah, Rahman, Rahim. Lovely, mashallah. Okay, can you tell me the name of this letter? Um, is that a noon? It is. Well done, excellent. Can you tell me the name of this sign on top of the noon? Uh, is it a suck? Sukun. Sukun. It's a sukun. Well done. Excellent. So the sign is called sukun, right? When you say the name of the letter, it is a noon sakin. That means a noon with a sukun on top. Okay, good. Well done. So what's the letter before? Um, an alif. Excellent. So if we're going to join now the alif to the noon, we will say an. An. Good. Well done. 
Now, this next letter, what's this one? Uh, that is a lamb. It's a lamb. And what's on top of the lamb? Um, a sakin, sakun. Sakun, well done. So this is a lamb sakin. Excellent, well done. The letter before is a? Za. Very good. And the za has a fata on the top. Okay, so we will join this and we will say zal. 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 Very good, well done. Now, we have two letters here with different strokes. Can you tell me the name of this stroke? Um, is that a... Um, I don't know. A vertical fata. A vertical okay. fata. Do you know how many seconds we need to say this letter for? Is it one, no, two counts? Good, excellent. So this letter is for two counts, two counts. And this is a ha with a what on top? A dhamma. Dhamma, well done. That is how many counts? One count. Very good. So we will say nahu. Nahu. Very good. So let's try and put that all together. Oh, sorry. Let's try and put that all together. And we say anzalnahu. Beautiful, well done, excellent. Now, over here, what kind, what would be the name of this lamb? What would be the name of this lamb? Uh, would it be a lamb? Good, well done. Uh, have a go, Lamsa. Lamsakin. Excellent. Well done. It's a Lamsakin. Well done. And um, before that, we have an alaf with a fata on top. So we will say al. Al. Very good. So how would we say these two letters? Um, um, would it be bala? Bala, no. separately. Ba -ba. Very good. Well done. So we have to make sure that they're separate letters. We're not going to join them. We're going to say Bala. Bala. Very good. And what's this letter here? Um, that is a Dal. Very good. And it has a Kasra. Do you know how we would say that? Um, D. Very good. Excellent. Very, very well done. So let's try and say that all together. We will say Al Bala D. Al baladi. Very good. Al baladi. Al baladi. Very nice. Lovely recitation, G796. Really good understanding, mashallah. Well done. Jazakumullah. Thank you for your help. Um, can my brother have a go? Um, yes, I, G797 is his number. I checked it and again, have a go. Okay. Jazakumullah. As as alaikum as -salam. How are you today? Good. How are Excellent. you? Excellent. Alhamdulillah. I'm very well. Zakman for asking. Could you start with Tabuz and Tasmia? Excellent. Very good. Mashallah. Okay. Um, so we're going to start from here now. Can you tell me the name of this letter? Had, no. Ha, well done. Ha, very good. Now, what's the name of this sign on top of that? Ha? Sakun. Very good. Excellent. So this is a ha sakin because the ha has a sukun on top. Very good. So we will say, we will join the alif that comes before the ha. We will join it and we will say ah. 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 Very good. Excellent. What's this letter here? Seen. Very good. 
Do you remember the name of this stroke? What do you think? What is this? Fata. Very good. Well done. This is a scene with a fata. So we will say sa. Sa. Very nice. Well done. And what letter is this? Which is it? Which one is this? Noon. Very good. And the stroke? Do you know? No. Do you don't know? I don't know. Okay, this is a kasra. This is a kasra. So this is a fatha, which comes on the top. And this is a kasra, which comes underneath. So we will say ni. Ni. Very good. Well done. Let's try and put that together. Okay, so we say... We're going to join the alif with the ha, and then we will say the sin with the fata and the noon with the kasa. So we will say ah sani. Ah sani. Beautiful. Ah sani. Ah sani. Very nice. Well done. Good. So, what kind of lamb is this? Do you know? Lamb. Sakin. Very good. A lamb with a scoon. So we call it a lamb sakin. Very nice. Well done. So we will say here, we will join the alif that comes before him. We will say al. Al. Very nice. What letter is this? Kaf. Very good. The kaf has a kasra. So we will say ki. Ki. Very good. Well done. Now we have two letters here. We have a tha and a ba. Do you know which stroke this is on top of the tha? Two. Two, two counts. Very well done. You have, will say this sound for two seconds or two counts or two beats. Do you know the name of the stroke? Vertical. Vertical fata. Very good. Well done. This is a vertical fata. And we will say the letter for two counts. Well done. So we will say ta. Sa. No, it's a ta. Ta. Yeah. Ta. Sa. No, it's a ta. 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 With ta. your tongue up, yeah. Ta. Ta. Very good. Ta. And smile a little when you're saying it so it sounds soft. Ta. Ta. Beautiful. Well done. Excellent. This this letter here is a ba. It has which stroke on top? Do you remember? Dama. Very good. We will say bu. Bu. Very good. So that's just one second or one count. Excellent. So let's try and put that word together now. We will say al kitabu. Al kitabu. Very nice. Al kitabu. Al kitab. Very good. Jazakumullah G7977. Lovely recitation. Well done. Jazakumullah. Allah Hafiz. Hafiz. Okay, good. Well done. Mashallah, everybody's doing really, really well today. You're all remembering your previous strokes, which is really important. So you need to remember the names of your previous strokes. You need to say how many seconds um, you will say that stroke for. So I'm, I'm just making sure that everyone's keeping up to date with that. So well done, Mashallah, really good. So can we have another student, please? Yep, our next student is G791. G791, Assalamualaikum. 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 Wa alaikum assalam. How are you? Good. Alhamdulillah. Excellent. Are you understanding everything okay? Yes. Brilliant. Yes. Mashallah. Well done. Okay. So if we start with Dawood and Tasmiya and then we'll begin. Um, is G1, G791 is going to go first or G792? Beautiful. Right, so over here we have the letter noon. On the noon, there is the stroke or the sign, sorry, the sign of 
sukun. So what will we call this letter? Noon sakin. Very good. Excellent. We will join the noon sakin to the alif that it comes before it and we will say an. An. Very nice. Well done. Over here, what would this letter be called? Meme sakin. Very good. Meme sakin because it's a meme with a sukun on top. The letter before is an ein, so we would join that to the meme. We will say am. 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 Very good. Now, what's this letter here? Ta. Ta. Well done. It has a fata. How would we say that? Do you know? Ta. Ta. Well done. Excellent. So let's put that now together. An am ta. An am ta. An am ta. An am ta. Very good. Well done. So we don't want to hold on the meme. We just say the meme softly. An am ta. An am ta. Very good. Well done. Lovely. Excellent. So over here we have two letters. Do you know what each of these letters are? For and alif. Excellent. They both have fata on the top. So how many seconds will we say each letter for? One. One second each. Well done. So we will say fa'a. Fa'a. Beautiful. Well done. Now, over here, what would we call this letter? Ra sakin. Brilliant. This is a ra with a sukun on the top. It is called a ra sakin. Well done. The letter before is a fa with a fata. So we would join that to the ra and we will say sar. 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 Right. So the letter fa, um, if you put your tongue under the front teeth in your mouth and you make a th, th sound. Th. Th. Very good. So we say thar. Thar. Very good. Well done. Excellent. What is this letter and how will we say it? Noon and we'll say na. Beautiful. Well, well done. Let's try and put that all together now. So we will make this word and we will say fa'a thar na. Fa'a thar na. Beautiful. Fa'a thar na. Fa'a thar na. Beautiful. Well done. Jazakumullah. Thank you so much for your help. Did you have a, a sibling um, that you wanted somebody else there? Yes, G1, um, G792. G792. A disciplining charge, is that okay? Yes, yes. Yeah, yes, brilliant. 792. Aslam alaikum. Aslam alaikum. Wa alaikum aslam. Is that G1792? Yes. Excellent. So if we start with Tawuz and Tasmiya. A'uzu billahi min shaitan al-rajim Bismillahir Rahmanir Rahim Excellent. Are you understanding everything today? Yes. Excellent. Good. So, if I say to you, uh, can you tell me the name of this letter? What will you tell me? Noon sakin. Brilliant. Noon sakin. And we will say, an. An. And um, what is the name of this letter? La sakin. Very good. We will say, zal. Zal. Very good. And how will we say these two letters? Na. Na hu. Brilliant. Two seconds and one second. Nah, Excellent. Let's put that all together. Oh, sorry. Let's put just this word. And we will say, Anzalnahu. 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 What letter is this? Noon. Noon, well done. 
anzalnahu an anzalna nu hu hu very good well done let's try another one let's do this one here okay this would be what letter is this sa sakin sin sin sakin sin sakin good we will say is is very good what letter is this ga ga sakin very good we will say tuck tuck very good and can you say these two letters bara 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 very good let's put that all together we will say is tuck bara is tuck bara very good is tuck bara is tuck bara very good jazak mulla g792 beautiful recitation thank you for your help alafis alafis excellent mashallah everybody is doing really really well you're recognizing the letters you're recognizing the sign of sakin and you're joining really well as well okay what we're going to go on to now is our next exercise where i we are not going to break um, the words down we are going to try to read the words continuously but following me and then um we will read the whole word together not the individual letters okay so if we could have our next student on the mic please yes our next student is g803 803 assalamu alaikum g803 how are you g803 can you hear me all right um we can another student then g808 g808 oh assalamu alaikum wa alaikum assalam is that g808 yes excellent how are you today good how are you alhamdulillah i'm very very well jazakum allah for asking um if we start with tawud and tasmiya أعوذ بالله من الشيطان الرجيم بسم الله الرحمن الرحيم. Excellent, mashallah. Can you tell me the name of this sign here? Um, noon second. Uh, so this is a, this letter is what it has two dots. So it is a da da. ta sakin well done ta sakin so the sign is called sukun when it's on top of the letter you say the letter by saying the name of the letter with sakin afterwards so ta sakin okay ta so let's read this whole word together okay nusibat 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 very good so you can actually hear that you're joining the ba to the ta Nusibat. <coughs> Nusibat. Very good. Well done. Let's do the next word. Ush hidu. Ush hidu. Hidu. Ush hidu. Ush hidu. Very good. Well done. Let's move to the next one. Now, before I ask you the next one, can you tell me the name of this stroke here? Of this sign? Um, um, not not um, this rule. No, no, no. Um, noon, noon second. So these, this stroke here, this is something you did earlier this week. It's tanveen. Okay, so when we say this, we will say kun, kun. Very good. So let's try this whole word. <coughs> bar kun, bar kun, bar. Bar, kun, kun, bar, kun, bar, kun. Beautiful. Well done. Let's move on. Next one. This is an ayn with a sukun. So this is what letter? Um, a sakin. 
Ain sakin. Well done. So this is now budu. Now budu. Now budu. Now budu. Very good. Well done. This is a scene with a sukun on top. So this is what letter? Seen, seen, um, seen sucking. Sucking. Very good. Well done. Excellent. So we would join the lamb before and we'll say lus. Lus. Da. 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 Lusta. Lusta. Very good. Well done. Excellent. Now, this is a lamb with a sukun. So this would be called a what? Um, Lam sakin. Brilliant. Well done. So let's say this word. Akul. Akul. Very nice. Well done. Now, again, what is this letter called? Lam. Lam sakin. No, lam Very sakin. good. Yes. Lam sakin. Well done. Excellent. So we will say mulku. 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 Very good. Jazakumullah G808. Lovely recitation. Well done. Hello, um, Fiz. Can, I'm like, um, can, can my sister go on? Um, her ID is G G809. Yeah, you can have a go. Okay. Assalamu alaikum G809. How are you? How are you? Alhamdulillah, I'm very well. Just like for asking, how are you? Good. Alhamdulillah, excellent. Um, so if we start with Tawood and Tasmiya. Okay. A'udhu billahi min shaytanir rajim. Bismillahirrahmanirrahim. Beautiful, well done. Can you tell me the name of this letter, please? Tu. It's Ta. And it has a sukun on top. So what will we call this? Ta sukun sakin. Ta sakin. Well done. Excellent. Ta sakin. Okay. So we will join the, the letter before to the ta and we will say kat. Kat. Very good. Well done. Now we're going to say the whole word together. Huli kat. Huli kat. Very good. Beautiful. Well done. What is the name of this letter? Ha sakin. Very good. Ha sakin. <coughs> Excellent. Well done. The letter before is a noon. We will join the noon to the ha, and then we'll have another noon at the end. So we will say nah nu. Nah nu. Nah nu. Nah nu. Very good. Well done. Excellent. <coughs> so let's just join these two letters first together and say. Hat. Hat. Very good. Now let's join the first two letters with that, and we will say, "Ra bi hat." Ra bi hat. Very good. Ra bi hat. Ra bi hat. Very nice. Well done. Excellent. Now we have a sukun in this uh, comes twice. Which two letters? Asakin letters. Can you tell me in this word? The lam and me. Excellent. Well done. So we have a lam sakin, a lam with a schoon on top, and a meme sakin, a meme with a schoon on top. Excellent. Good. <coughs> so we will have kul tum. Kul tum. Kul tum. Kul tum. Beautiful. Well done. Excellent. Now, what's the name of this letter here? Noon Sakin. Excellent. Noon Sakin. So we will say here, Zila. Zila. Beautiful. Zila. Zila. Very good. Well done. Now, again, we have two Sakin letters in this word. What are those two letters? Meme second and I'm second. Okay. Do you remember the name of this letter here? Hamza. It looks a little bit like an Ain. Ahamza. Well done. This is Ahamza. So this is Hamza second 
and a meme sakin. Okay, so the way we will say this is shit dum. Shit dum. Shit dum. Shit dum. Very good. Excellent. Well done. And let's try this one here. So we have an ein with a fata followed by which letter here right at the end? A tasakin. Well done. Excellent. So we will say. Rufi at Rufi at Rufi at Rufi at Very good. Jazakumullah G eight zero nine. Lovely recitation. Well done. Allah Hafiz. Excellent. Well done. So if we could have another student, please. Yes. Our next student is G842. G842. Assalamualaikum. G842, Assalamu alaikum. Wa alaikum assalam. How are you today? I'm fine, how are you? Alhamdulillah, I'm very well. Jazakumullah for asking. Are you understanding everything okay? Yes. Excellent. So if we start with Dawood and Tasmiya. A'uzu billahi minash shaitanir rajeem. Bismillahir rahmanir rahim. Beautiful, well done. Now, what's the name of this letter here in the middle? It's a Seen Sakin. Excellent, Seen Sakin. Now, do you remember what this is here at the end? A Fata Tawin. Good, well done. And so it's a Tanveen, so we will say at the end, Nan. Nan. Excellent. Now, let's join the first two letters. So we will say, Hus Nan. Husnan. Beautiful. Well done. Excellent. Let's go on to the next one. Do you remember how to say this letter at the end? Dun. Very good. Well done. Excellent. So we will say this is an ein with a sukun. So it's ein sakin. We will say radun. 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 Very good. Well done. Let's move on to this one. Uh, which letter is our sakin letter in this? The noon. Excellent. We have a noon sakin here. Okay. So in this, we will say tunziru. 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 Very good. Excellent. Well done. Let's move on. Uh, how will we say this last letter? Sin. 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 Very good. Sin. Sin. So the first two letters we will join the noon to the Farsakin. We will say naf. Naf. Naf sin. Naf sin. Good. So we're making that nasal sound, the sound that comes from your nose. Remember? Nafsin. Nafsin. Very good. I always find it helps if you sort of twist up your nose a little bit and you really think about where the air is coming from in this and um, when you have Tanveen. Okay, let's go on to the next one. Which are our sucking letters in this example? The noon and the re. Good. The noon and the ra. Well done. So we have in her. In her. Very good. In her. In her. Very good. Well done. Next one. How will we say these two letters, the first two letters? Ar. Ar. Well done. Excellent. Ar sala. Ar sala. Very good. Excellent. How will we say these two letters, the first two? Um. Um. Well done. And how will we say the second two? Lam. Very good. Am lam. Am lam. Very good. Well done. Jazakumullah G842. Lovely recitation. Well done. Lafiz. Lafiz. Actually. Sorry. Was there something? Um, I accidentally muted. Uh, okay. 
Okay, yeah. never mind. Okay, if we could have our next student, please. Yes, our next student is G841. G841. Assalamu alaikum. Assalamu alaikum. Wa alaikum assalam. How are you today? Good, how are you? Alhamdulillah, I'm very well. Um, if we start with Dawood and Tasmiya and then we'll move on. Beautiful, well done. Okay, so we're on this line here. Can you tell me um, which two letters are our second letters in this example? Jim and Lam. Good. There's a jim sakin and a lam sakin. Well done. So we make the joining sound from the ya to the jim. We say yaj. 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 Good. And then we make the joining sound from the ayn to the lam. Al. Al. Yaj al. Yaj al. Very good. Well done. Excellent. Can you tell me the name of this letter? Meme sucking. And this letter? Noon sucking. Beautiful. Well done. How we we'll say this? We will say Kuntum. 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 Mm. Very good. Well done. Excellent. Again, we have um, a noon sucking and a meme sucking. Here we will say Antum. 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 Very good. Well done. Excellent. Um, so, which is our sucking letter here? Hmm. The ha. Well done. Ha. So, we have ha sucking. Okay. So, we say na. Na. Nu. Nu. Na. Nu. Na. Nu. Very good. Na. Nu. Na. Nu. Excellent. Well done. Now, can you tell me how we are going to join this alif with the fatah to this za sakin here? As. Very good. As. As. Very. So remember the za is a thick sound. So we have to try and make that thick sound when we join. As lama. As lama. Beautiful. Well done. Excellent. Can you tell me how we will join this alif to this sin sakin? Us. Us. Well done. Excellent. Us. Fala. Us. Fala. Beautiful. Well done. And which is our second letter here? Noon. Noon. Well done. Kuntu. Kuntu. Very good. Kuntu. Kuntu. Beautiful. Jazakumullah G841. Lovely recitation. Allah Hafiz. Hafiz. Excellent. If we could have another student on the mic, please. Yes, our next student is G829. G829. Assalamu alaikum, G829. Assalamu alaikum. Someone there? G829? Oh, wa alaikum assalam. How are you today? Good. Excellent. Good. Understanding everything okay? Yeah. Perfect. Well done. Um, if we start with Dawood and Tasmiya and then we'll move on. <laughs> Lovely, well done. Okay, so um, let's go here. Can you tell me the name of this letter, please? Grass sucking. Well done. Can you join the first letter to the second letter? Ba. Bar. 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 Very good. Well done. Barkun. Barkun. Beautiful. Well done. Excellent. Now, how many second letters do we have in this example? Two. And which are they? Lam, lam sucking and mim sucking. Brilliant. Well done. Excellent. So here we will say qultum. Qultum. Very good. Well done. Excellent. 
what about this one? Let's see. Now, can you remember how we say this last letter here? Sin. Right. So this is the the Naveen. So we say sin. Sin. Good. So we make that nasal sound, the sound that, that's coming from your nose pipe. Sin. Very good. So we have naf sin. Naf sin. Very nice. Well done. Excellent. Now let's think about, let's see this one. Let's do this one here. How will we say these first two letters? As. As. Well done. As lamu. Oh, sorry. As lama. As lama. Beautiful. So we don't elongate the meme at the end. As lama. As lama. Beautiful. Well done. Excellent. Let's try one more. Let's do this one here. Which is our second letter here? Uh, okay. The second. Well done here at the end. Can you join those last two letters for me, please? Uh, uh, but. Well done. But. Excellent. So how will we say this? We will say Kulikat. 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 Coolie cut. Very good. Let's try one more. Let's do this one here. So we have two meme sakins here, but the letters before um, are different. So how will we say this first two letters? Um, um, um and how will we say the second one? Lum. Lum. And when we put that together, we say um lum. Um, lum. Very good. Well done. Jazakamullah G8. Two nine beautiful recitation. Well done. Jazakumullah. Allah Hafiz. Assalamualaikum. Excellent. Well done, students. Brilliant lesson. So, just a reminder today we have been looking at a new sign called um, a sukun. The sign is called the sukun. It looks like a tiny little dal on top of a letter here. Um, when a letter carries a sukun, um, we call that letter a sakin letter. So whichever the letter is, that will be your sakin letter. So for example, this is a lam sakin. This is a nun sakin. Um, this is a kaf sakin, right? So the sign is called sukun. The letter, you say the letter name and then sakin afterwards to show it is a letter bearing a sukun, right? And what you do with that is you join the previous vowed letter to that letter okay you join them together right so your homework for today is to practice exercise 12.2 that is the second exercise that we completed today this one um at least two lines please two rows um, and make sure you sound all the letters clearly when you're joining as well okay excellent so if we could have our final student for the final prayer yes it's G720. G720. Assalamu alaikum. G720. G720. Okay, we'll turn another student then. G71. Oh, is that G720? Yes. Okay, Assalamu alaikum G720. Okay, if we start with Tawuz and Tasmiya, and then we'll read our final prayer. So we say, A'udhu Billahi min ash shaitan ir rajim, Bismillahi rahman ir rahim. A'udhu Billahi min ash shaitan ir rajim, Bismillahi rahman rahim. Allahumma rahamni bil Quran al azim. Allahumma rahmi hamni bil Quran al azim bil Quran al azim 
Aveen. Very good effort. Oh, Allah have mercy on me through the Quran the Great. Oh, Allah have mercy on me through the Quran the Great. Waja al Huli. Wajala Ishi. Waja al Huli. Wajal Huli. Ima Mongwa Nurongwa. Ima Mongwa Nurongwa. Nurongwa. Who don't wara ma? Who do wa? Madamba Rahma Rahma. Good. I'm just going to recite it once and then you can recite the translation. Waja alahuli imamangwa nurangwa. Who don't wara ma? And you can recite the translation. And make it for me the leader, the light, the guardian, guidance, guidance, and the mercy. Beautiful. Jazakumullah to all students and all parents. And inshallah, we will see you again tomorrow. Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuhu.